Every year, millions of Americans are affected by venous disorders of the lower extremities. And Dr. Comfort's Shape to Fit compression wear is perfect to help address these conditions. With various style choices, compression levels, and materials, Shape to Fit will benefit all of your patients. Shape to Fit compression wear is a quality line of products which are constructed with seamless and latex-free materials. Not only was the construction considered in the product, but also the packaging in which it comes in. Each package is made of sturdy material with an easy open slide construction for your patients to view and touch the compression. Also, the boxes are color coded with the shades of pink for women, shades of blue for men, and shades of green for unisex. The lighter the shade, the lower the compression. Also, the size, color, and material and compression level are also listed at the top of the box. In this video, Linda will be demonstrating measuring and fitting for compression wear, which, in my opinion, is easier than measuring for shoes. Through the use of the assistive devices and these helpful tips, it will ensure success for you and your patient. Hi, I'm Linda Hagen, and I'm with Dr. Comfort Shape to Fit. Today we're going to show you how to don and measure for graduated compression hose. The first thing you want to do is have the patient remove their stockings. Today, Kathleen is our model, and she does not have any ankle swelling, so it wouldn't matter what time we measure her. If someone does have ankle swelling, you may want to measure them the first thing in the morning. When you measure, you want the smallest part of the ankle above the bone and the widest part of the calf. The widest part of the calf sometimes can be found by pushing on the calf muscle. Take your tape measure, measure around the ankle, and Kathleen measures a nine, nine inches, and the widest part of the calf and Kathleen measures 15 and a half. Then you can look on your Dr. Comfort Shape to Fit box on the side and see where the corresponding size is. It would be a medium for Kathleen, or you can look in the Dr. Comfort Shape to Fit product selection guide. And here are all our measurements. So we have a medium compression hose for Kathleen, and I'm going to don that for her. You take the stocking, Put your hand in the inside. Take your thumb and forefinger and press the heel together. Continue to hold that heel while you turn the stocking inside out. You make a pocket for the foot and then continue to don over the foot, pull it over the heel. It is best not to wear jewelry or rings when you're donning a graduated compression hose because they can snag, run, or pull. Then you work the stocking up to about one inch below the knee. Sometimes it works to use donning gloves and Dr. Comfort Shape to Fit offers those. These are a tacky surface and you can continue to straighten out the hose with the gloves. How does that feel, Kathleen? Then we can continue to remove the stocking, and that is called doffing. It is best to use a technique like a banana peel. You just pull it off the, off the foot like this, because if you push it all the way down, now you've got about 30 rubber bands you're trying to pull over the foot, and that works a little bit more easily. Another donning technique is using our open toe compression hose. In that box comes a toe slip. That makes it easy for the stocking to don with an open toe stocking. Our model today is Brian, and he's going to show us how to do that. The toe slip goes over the toe, and then you use the same technique of putting your hand into the stocking and pinching the heel with your thumb and forefinger. Pull that inside out, make a little pocket. Now this time it's very easy to slide it over because there isn't anything to restrict you with the toes and it makes it easy for that toe slip to glide over. Again, pull the stocking up to about one inch below the knee. It may need a little readjusting, that's normal. And then pull the toe slip out. With this, you can wear another stocking over it. You can wear sandals, it's a little cooler. Or if someone has large feet, sensitive toes, hammer toes or bunions, this might be the perfect option for them. Another way to don a stocking is using the metal stocking donner that Dr. Comfort Shape to Fit make. It is a little bit more sturdy. What you want to do is keep the clothes part toward the body and use a sock 
it is a lot easier to don using a sock versus something sheer because it can be a little more difficult to get it on. You push the sock down till you make a nice heel pocket. Then, if someone can't sit or bend with hip or knee problems, you set that there for the patient. Make sure they have a table or something very sturdy to balance themselves on. Point the toe, step down into it, and pull up with the handles. Sometimes it needs readjustment. You can expect Dr. Comfort's Shape to Fit line of compression wear to be the same superior quality as the other Dr. Comfort products. We hope this video was helpful to you and your patients. And as always, please contact Dr. Comfort at www.drcomfort.com or contact us at 1-800-556-5572 for any questions or to order any of the products you saw here. Thank you.